So tell me where you're from. Rogers, Arkansas. And tell me why you came. First of all, tell me where do you work? Uh, Dr. Nick Yanus' office. <laughs> <laughs> so you've seen a lot of this uh, occlusal slash TMJ stuff mm -hmm. over the years, right? Yeah. Yeah, so tell us your story. Tell us what happened. Um, so originally it just started off, uh, minor headaches, nothing too bad. Um, I knew I always had neck issues, so I knew that wasn't really like much of a factor of what you played. I knew you were able to identify it. Um, but it's, it's recently gotten worse within the past year or so, and mm -hmm. I've been getting really bad headaches and migraines where it's just kind of debilitating. Two weeks ago, we did the diagnostics for NOS. Um, Dr. Nick found quite a few things wrong with me, one including my neck. Um, he also decided that I was a good candidate for the MAG treatment. Not everyone is, um, but he ultimately just caught my bite up to the status of my joints. My joints are a little torn, but um, they're well adapted for now. So we're gonna keep an eye on it, hopefully in the next year or so I can get a new MRI, make sure everything's still looking good. For the MAG treatment, it's measured anterior guidance treatment. Um, so he looks at my bite with a sensor hooked up to EMGs. He can tell you know, what my muscles are doing with certain movements and that's how he's able to fix my bite. Um, and relax my muscles doing so. Um, so you basically caught my bite up with the status of my joints. Um, so you did a small adjusting on the occlusal surface of my teeth and my bite feels a lot more even. Um, I can move left and right a lot better. I don't shake as bad as I used to. Um, and it's, it's relaxed my face muscles a lot. Is it hard for you to move your jaw left and right? It just shakes, it shakes a, a little lot, bit. yeah. 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 Headaches. I haven't had any since. A couple days after treatment, I think my muscles were a little confused with what was happening because um, I did get a decent migraine over the weekend. I had some sharp pains in my temples, but it got a lot better the following day and I haven't had any issues since. And I had a headache before we started the bite adjustment. I was telling Kennedy, um, I don't anymore. Mm-hmm. So cold, I never really noticed much of an issue. I'm a big ice cream fan, so besides not biting into it with the front teeth, I've always had that issue. I didn't think much of it. Um, but now I can eat ice cream and not have to worry about it. All right, ice water, zero to 10. What is that? Yeah, like an eight or nine. So now I can eat like a normal person with ice cream and popsicles. I don't have any issues, which is good. So after addressing my bite, it's helped a lot. I'm about probably 90% better from where I currently was two weeks ago. I haven't had any issues. Um, I do know I need to find a chiropractor to address my upper C-spine since we can't do it as a dental office here. Okay, so when you open, you swing off to your left. Your left is weak, you see that? So the orthodontist had you in braces for how many years? Technically five, and then I went through Invisalign. Look at her anterior though. Tell us why you're here, what's going on? Um, I've recently been having a lot of migraines and a lot of it stems from the temples. Mm -hmm. um, I've also been having a little bit of cracking whenever I chew on my right side. Yeah. And then, Whenever I yawn a lot, I get like almost like Charlie horses down yeah. here. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, just pain mainly. So the, you call them migraines, but are they stimulated by sound and light, or is it something? Not different? not always, but when they are bad, I have to turn off the lights. Like they even make me throw up. Yeah, that sounds like a bad. migraine. Yeah. But it could be something layered over it too. So are there times where you don't have that kind of um, intensity? Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. There's times where you'll just have a, a headache in your temple. Mm -hmm. So you could have a temporalis problem, like a tension headache, resulting of what we treat on top of true migraines. You could have two problems, not just one. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what about the neck? The neck ever jack with you? Yeah, it, it pops a lot, like makes crackling noises when I move a certain way. Do you get pain in the side of your face? Um, no, I get like a tingling, like goosebump feeling on the side of my face. Right side, left, both? Right side. Right side only. Mm-hmm. Ever have it on your left? 
if I do, it's rare. You ever have tingling down your arms? Yes, yeah. Which side? Um, mainly left, but sometimes, like, my left and right arms go numb mm -hmm. easily. Yeah, that's C-spine stuff, mm -hmm. probably. Yeah. Yeah. You ever seen a neurologist for all this? No. Mm -mm. Yeah. Chiropractor? No. Okay. I don't want them popping my neck. All right. Um, how sensitive are your teeth? To cold? Yeah. I'm very sensitive. Great. And open. Nice. Than I thought it went. Or, or to the left. Unopen. And then uh, you're going right to the left. It should be shut down below eight. Look at it. Is it hard for you to move your jaw left and right? It just shakes. It shakes a, a little lot. bit. Yeah. 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 After work. Oh, okay. Okay. Go ahead and give me a swish now. Okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. Still same? Ooh, the Back. left side. Yeah. Left side's kind of bad, like a nine, but right side. Like a three. And what? Just, just two minutes ago, it was a what? Like a nine. It was eight or nine everywhere. Wow. Yeah. So you see what happened in about 30 seconds? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's crazy. How you feeling? Good. Yeah, it's like a zero on the right side. That took me all, what, 30 seconds? Yeah, yeah. it's crazy. <laughs> you sort of get this? Mm -hmm. What happened? It's like a, a zero. zero on the right. But the right side's like nothing now. Yeah, nothing on the right. right. Okay. Back together. I'm not trying to move right. So spasm a little bit. At the very end, yeah. Arm, left. Open. So she's showing that the relations in her. Uh, still a bit close, though. I feel it a little bit. I would say maybe a four or five it kind of hits me a little late but it's not an eight or nine anymore uh-uh no that's a lot better so dennis whenever they do fillings of deposits like just now i'm recontouring her flat deposit <laughs> they slap it in there all right they don't respect the anatomy mm. and she's got a lot of anatomy <laughs> she has a lot of anatomy except for her fillings are it's flat as a board right? oh, yeah. mm, like this mm. yeah i run my tongue in it all the time yep. it's so smooth <laughs> mm. yep. try biting now now I want you to move your jaw over sideways. You Don't still shake have that as much. No, there is a, a tiny bit, but yeah, it's already changing, isn't it? Yeah. Try moving left. Tell me if it's still shaking. Nowhere near as bad, is it? Not as bad. What is it? Really nothing. Maybe maybe a one. Can't really even pinpoint where. Like, and everything feels a lot more relaxed and like not tense and achy anymore like it did. Yeah, so that's profoundly different? Mm hmm yeah. 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 I even I had a headache before we started the bite adjustment, I was telling Kennedy. Um, I don't anymore. Gone. Mm-hmm. I'm very glad I had it done. Um, I suggest anyone, if you have any symptoms with your jaw, if you've told you've had TMJ issues, um, that you need to, you know, really watch the videos, do your research, um, come here if you can, because it, even if you aren't a candidate for treatment, you leave knowing what your issues are and you're guided in the correct direction.